this is a very special occasion in the Kosovo capital of Pristina. It is still the second youngest team that Gareth Southgate has ever named, and there are actually less caps on the field at the start of tonight's game than there were against Montenegro on Thursday. So in that sense, it's the second least experienced team that Southgate has named. Oxley chamberlain which come for Winks! Nicely tucked away. Harry Winks, his first international goal, just passed into the corner of the net. And with a little over half an hour gone, England take the lead from an unlikely source, Harry Winks. Well, it's a terrific goal, and Gareth will be delighted with that because he's played Winks in a sort of a number eight position, allowing him to get forward more than that sort of holding position that he plays at Tottenham or he has been playing for England, and he's proved that he can come up with a goal. So it's a nice, neat little bit of play from England. They link up well, and there's the run. He just touches it. His first touch is excellent, and uh, the rest is easy for him. He just shows it, the keeper one side, tucks it in the near post, and uh, really good goal from Wink's point of view. It's well played by Mings to Wink's. Rice. Sterling. He's found a cross. And it came off Aliti and Kane! And Harry Kane just slots it home. Sweet finish at the far post. And a sweet moment for Harry Kane. Another goal, another landmark, all three. And England double their lead. And should be safe from here inside the last 15 minutes. It's Kane again. Yeah, good finish again, but it's Sterling's little change of pace that caught the Kosovo in a defence out. This is where it looks like Sterling's not taking it on. He looks to, for support inside, change of pace, just puts it in there, it's dreadful defending. But under pressure, Kane keeps a cool head and manages on the half volley just to deal with the spin of the ball. It's, it's more difficult than it looks, that. He's under pressure. There's a lot of spin on that ball, and it's a good finish from Harry Kane. Here's Sterling. Real options, Marcus Rashford. Oh, what a finish! That is so precise, so calm, so cool, and so beautifully struck by Marcus Rashford, and England are three up. Yeah, beautiful goal, well taken from Rashford, but you've got to give Sterling a lot of credit. The actual weight of pass, the timing of the pass and the weight of pass, excellent. So he can actually stroke it first time. This is where uh, a lot of space there, look at that space you find there. And it's the timing and the weight of pass, just right, but a terrific finish, it really is. Just wraps his foot round it, doesn't have to hit it, oh, just guides it into that bottom corner and... Um, he has scored from the bench now, by the way. Oh, a slip there. Critically by Dresovic, and England capitalise, and that's a lovely, lovely moment for Mason Mount. First senior international goal for the young Chelsea player. Gifted to him. England have got four, four more goals, goals, goals in this qualifying campaign, and they will go to the finals next year. Well, he'll remember this for the rest of his life, his first goal in an England shirt. It's a dreadful mistake, isn't it? Again, good pressing from England. There's a slip, as you said, all day. Uh, the pitch is a bit greasy on top, but it Mount takes it really well. 